Doing acoustic versions of full songs is a whole other experience, especially live. You have so much control over the air and the feel and the, the way the crowd's looking at you or the, the way people sing or the way people walk away feeling. And I love that. You don't necessarily get that with a full band performance. That's got its own power, but you have power over every second of that performance. And you can hold it out, you can create silence which is a power I've only recently discovered when you hold off or you drag something out or you don't sing for a moment. So, so much there to be discovered when it's just you and a guitar. I think when you're translating something acoustically as well, you have to let the way you feel in that performance lead where that song is gonna go. And a lot of the time when I'm doing acoustic versions, I change the bridge or I'll change the outro or I'll, or I'll add a melodic part because that's where it feels like it needs to go. And you have to listen to the way that, the way that guides you for how the song's gonna be formatted and how you're gonna sing it. Um, to go back to muscle memory, there's this part in the bridge that I just drew it out longer and longer, added more vocals, and it just created this like suspense that wasn't there in the original. Um, and I love that about, about it. You can, you can stop and then pick it back up and you're still in there. You've still created that air and there's just, I love that. And I, I probably get the least nervous. Uh, as vulnerable and as exposed as you are with your acoustic, I get the least nervous for doing those performances because I get to control every second of it. So just cool.